it's John at the Super Awesome Geek Show, and today we have Decepticon Rumble Blue version. Blue, rum to Rumble Blue. I don't know why they said blue like that. I don't know what that means. Rumble Blue. <laughs> like, Frenzy was the red one, so I don't know what you're talking about. Um, shows him in all of his uh, modes, so he has... A robot mode, he's got the th thumper things that we saw in the cartoon, and he can turn into a cassette. So we're gonna we're gonna check this all out. He's very little. Very little, very little. So there we go. We've got two of these little rumble sticks that can go onto his arms and make him be like doom 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 like he did in the cartoon all the time. And then we have these these um the wing parts that go on his back. They'll probably clip on with some pegs there, yep. Yeah. Those are his weapons. They go on his back or on his arms. And then we have him rumble himself here as a robot. He looks pretty neat. Boom, 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 boom. And his hands, they do not pivot, but these do go in. Ah, uh, his head does turn. Oh, it's on a little... Oh, because it's going to fold up into the cassette. I got you. So it's on a little rock. And then his legs do move. They, he has knee joints. So he can go in and out, to up and down. Knee joints. He's got twists. And his feet can move around a little bit, like, because of the transformation bits. So that's cool. Neat. Let's look at the instructions here. Instructions. So they're saying the guns can go there. I bet the guns can go on his back. Yeah, they, there they go. They can go on his back. And then uh, you're going to twist the arms up, fold the hands in, and then clip the oh, the little things on to do that. Okay, so... You're basically going to do this and fold these hands in. Do this and fold these hands in. And then put them in there like that. Slide them in. So it slides into this hole there. Shunk. Why'd the other one just slide in like perfectly and now this one won't slide on? Jeez. There we go. Bend his lead legs a little bit and you can So he can like he did in the cartoons. These don't come Yeah, these don't move in and out. There's no kind of be neat if they could go in and out but I don't they don't seem to move well no it's just coming off that's what's going on yeah they don't really move I guess you could kind of pull them down a little bit right you could put them you could barely put them on and then that would be a little bit of movement so you can get a little bit more out of them there you go it's pretty neat. I suppose they do have his legs bent in the uh, in that pretty much, yeah. Hmm. All right, let's see how these clip on here. We got some. So there's a hole on his back and a peg here, so they can go. Um, like that. Neat. Make the full effect for this guy. Cool. Neat little guy. Alright, let's take him and put him in cassette mode. I'm not going to get these off now. Dang it. Eh. Yeah, and the other one comes off just fine. So let's put him in cassette mode. That means we turn his head, tuck it down, put his hands up, feet 
lock into place and then the hands come down. All right. So the head's going to go back into this little space here. Um, you can turn it around so that it's hidden. And then the hands, we want to come up, get into spot. Now these, these legs are going to, let's see, somehow tuck up in here. this way there they go you want to line that little piece up so you want to line it up that way there you go and then fold these in and then the arms how are they gonna work again they go Ah, oh, there they go. Okay. And then they kind of tuck in there. So you want to push them back. Push the arms back. So you're going to, normally they're going to be kind of like that. You want to make sure you push them back over the head part. And then line up the little notch with that. So it makes sort of a rudimentary cassette tape. There we go. Line up the notches. All the notches are lined up and the other side looks like that so that's the that's him in cassette mode and he'll fit i don't my sound wave is buried at the moment so he would but he would fit in sound wave trust me <laughs> yeah he'll fit in there i'm sure yeah <laughs> I'm going to put the um, arm thingies on because I think that's pretty cool. So I'm going to put them on. And his little things on the back. I'll put on there. And there. Cool. Oh, we got a leg turned around here. There we go. <laughs> Alrighty, guys. Thanks a lot for watching. This has been a presentation of the Decepticon Rumble. I hope you guys enjoyed this one. Thanks a lot for checking them out with me. And uh, stay awesome out there, everyone. We will catch you on the next video. Appreciate you stopping by and watching. Thank you to everyone who is a Patreon supporter. And thank you so much to all of you guys who are members right here on YouTube. Really appreciate you guys helping out the channel. And uh, there's loads of cool stuff coming up, including there may be some giveaways for Christmas. So all you guys who are members in, of Patreon and members of the YouTube channel here, right on YouTube, Keep an eye out because there may be some cool stuff coming up. I hope, I hope and pray. I'm, I'm hoping to have some things for Christmas for you guys. Or at least a chance for you to win something, you know. <laughs> All right, cool. Stay awesome, guys, and we'll see you later. Have a great Thanksgiving.